How to replace a heater matrix or heater core on a BMW Mini. The first thing you'll need to do is drain the coolant. Remove the shield that protects the engine that's underneath. Put a container below to collect any antifreeze that comes out. Undo the filler cap. Now you want to undo the hose at the bottom of the radiator, which is this one right here. You'll need a pair of pliers. Coolant drained out. The cover to the heater matrix is located in the footwell. It is held on by three screws. I had a hard time getting to the third screw, so I had to look behind the panel, and in doing so, I've snapped it. So at this point, I just tore it off. I don't recommend you doing this by shortcutting this job. Take your time, find that third screw, and take it off properly. The third screw is located up behind here. Put a tray below the matrix to catch any coolant that comes out. Remove the screws holding the heater matrix into the dash. Use an Allen key to remove the clips on the pipes. New heater matrix. I'm going to put some water down the pipes leading to the heater matrix to clear out all the brown gunge. You will need to replace the seals and clips to get a good seal on the new heater matrix. Remove old seals. dry and clean pipes. New seals on. The pipes are an absolute nightmare to get on. You may want to get help from another person to hold the pipe to the matrix as you put the clips on. And you'll probably need some needle nose pliers to put the clips close enough together to get the screw through. Now all you need to do is reconnect all the hoses and fill full of coolant. I am doing a detailed video on a coolant change so if you run into any problems you can view that. So stay tuned for that and you're done.